CNN it's perhaps the most coveted prize in horse racing, a feat only 12 thoroughbreds have achieved in the past century. At this weekend's Belmont Stakes on Long Island, the 150th anniversary of the New York race, Justify has the chance to join the exclusive club of Triple Crown winners after triumphs at the Kentucky Derby and Preakness Stakes earlier this year. Justify would become just the second horse to win the esteemed Triple Crown since 1978, with the Great American Fair the most recent horse to complete the sweep in 2015. Kentucky Derby and Preakness Stakes winner American Pharaoh wins the 147th running of the Belmont Stakes in New York on Saturday, June 6, to become the first horse to win the Triple Crown since affirmed did so in 1978. This horse is starting to act like Pharaoh, said Baffert of Justify, which recently became the first Derby winner in 136 years that did not to race as a two-year-old. I think I see a lot of resemblance in these two, the way they move, when I worked him after the Preakness, American Pharaoh, when he would breathe, he was like he was a machine. And this horse is getting there. Justify, ridden by 52-year-old Mike Smith, won a rain-soaked Kentucky Derby ahead of good magic in May before handing Baffert a record equaling 14th race win in one of the Triple Crown events at the Preakness just two weeks later. While each of the three races date back to the second half of the 19th century, the concept of the Triple Crown wasn't conceived until several decades later. Gallant Fox became the first horse to popularize the term with his success in 1930, although it was Sir Barton in 1919 that first won the three races in the same year. Mm -hmm.